I think I knew when I began my exploration into the world of encaustics that there would be no tentative dipping of toes. Beeswax and tree resin melt so seductively in the pot, combining satisfying crackle with delicious smells. There is no going back. Encaustic art offers me just about everything I need, both in the rhythm of the making processes and in the nature of the medium. I love the dynamic immediacy of working with molten wax and blowtorch, elemental stuff. The pleasing physicality of rubbing oil colour and ground chalk pastels into the surface. Layers of it. Scraping and smoothing and incising. Making subtle marks and visceral gouges. And then, the hint of danger. Or at least nervous uncertainty. Finely wrought lines and colour can disappear in a moment of unmeasured blowtorch use. Sometimes what remains can be exciting and better. Silk fibres blend so beautifully in melted wax trails too. As layers are laid down, fine silken tendrils appear vein-like, or like striations in marble slabs. The visual depths created by numerous layers of wax are both luminous and somehow mysterious. I love that tiny marks made on the panel at the beginning still have presence after maybe 20 layers of wax have been added. There is a continuity in that. I just love it all.